Welcome back to Wuppo! I have not looked up the store artifact locations because I feel like if I even look up anything regarding the store artifacts, I'm just immediately going to see how many there are, where they all are located, and what they do. It's gonna be very hard to like not read that if I even just search for store artifacts Wuppo. Oh, don't- wait, why? Why are you killing these guys? Oh no, I guess he does that. Yeah, he does do that normally, it's just he doesn't do it to special... special dudes like Carlo and stuff. So I guess that's a way you can maybe kill the, the cooks. Who's your friend? Okay, wait, so... Police one? Hey, check me out. It's been a while, I hope you've had a... Ah, ha Jesus, hope you've had a good time. How was it? How was Popo City? Uh, oh boy. Terrible? I should have saved before this. If I just say never mind. Okay, bye. Oh, but then I have to do it again, just confirm. Yeah, okay, hold on, hold on. So, never mind. And we'll save, and then I'll test both. So first off, we'll say terrible. Just to, like, guilt trip him, because he kicked me out. Oh, that doesn't sound good. So what's the plan now? I want to live here again! I haven't prepared for this. Do you think that you've changed enough to be able to not spill ice cream anymore? I have changed. Oh, okay. Then, I guess you can live here again? Nobody asked for the room I gave you the last time you were here, so you can stay there? Either way, I'm not serving you ice cream anymore. In fact, I'm not serving anyone anything anymore. Well, except for Birdie. He really needs the food, but he can clean up after himself. Who's Birdie? So, welcome back then, huh? And that's it. I'm thinking of going to Popa City myself now. Or should I open a store? Maybe both. Hmm. Hold on. We should just load and test the other option before I go through all of that dialogue. Awesome! Oh, okay. Good. I'm glad. So what's up now? I want to live here again. Nothing. Okay, I guess you should be going then, huh? Oh, uh, just in case you want to know, I stopped serving food to Wums, so I guess that if you ever wanted to live here again, it would be alright. See you. Aha, okay, alright, so I'm gonna say Popa City is awesome, but I want to live here again. I want to live here again. And yeah, that's the same. Not really. I have not changed. Ugh, whatever. You shouldn't be able to spill too much because I stopped giving Wums any food. Well, except for Birdie, without the, like, green text now. Alright, well... Again, I don't think this matters, but I want to choose, like, the optimal options. I could have just kept going with that. So, awesome. Live here. I've changed. Alright, so now we just go through the options. Popa City, whoops. Open a store. Maybe both. Hmm. Or maybe I should just retire. I should probably retire, yes. Do you think I should retire? You deserved it. Oh god, now I have to do it all over again. I don't know. The bum house might still need me. Ugh, can't decide. Well, you probably have something fun to do now, right? Hey, uh... Shouldn't you go do something now? Dot dot dot, that bell sound is getting a bit annoying! 
Stop it? Oh, come on. Don't be childish now. Oh boy, they sure love their dialogue and just writing infinitely chaining dialogue. I'm going to ignore you. This isn't bothering me at all. I barely notice the sound now. This is fine. Smile. I can deal with it. The bell sound is just noise now. What was I doing? Ah, deciding what to do with my life. Hmm. I'm thinking of going to Popo City myself now, and it loops. Okay, well in that case I can just actually use that other option without loading. And I can do that too. Probably retire. No, he should not retire. No? You're probably right. The one house might still need me. Or... Ah, I cannot decide what to do! Alright. Okay. Goodbye, Carlo. Enjoy whatever you decide to do, retirement or otherwise. But we are done with the one house for now. And yeah, he starts chucking things at things. Oh, and yeah, before we go to Blusser Islands, I guess we should go down here again. And try and explore the tunnel, because I definitely left a film strip somewhere here. I don't know where or how you get it, but I should definitely check this again. Oops. But no hurt lion. I just did. I'm sorry. Wait, oh god. Now he's just killing everyone. This place cozy. Was that supposed to be a misspelling of cozy? We live here now. Friend, I found many smart. Give me like two smart. Okay, like Five. Yeah, and that's nothing. But now we can just kill them. Wait, can you even kill them? I mean, I have much better weapons now, so... Maybe I can, like, out-DPS their healing? Plus I have some AoE. I can even use the bazooka if I need to. Yeah, I think I'm killing them. No? Are they not dying? I just want to kill the shaman guy. But maybe that's not possible. He just seems to be healing faster than you can possibly damage him. Yeah. Doesn't seem like you can actually kill anyone here. Oh, like that I can kill them when he's out of range. And now I can do my full DPS on this guy. I guess you just can't kill the king. He won't die because he's special. Yeah, okay, so that's how it works. Never mind that then. And I can't go up here. Damn. So we have to go all the way around. Oh boy. You know, I'll I'll just get there. Give me a second. Yeah, that was a pretty good jump, and nothing happened, so I don't think you can do anything there. Oh, I can't even get up here. 
I did realize that just using the bazooka to travel is actually probably faster than just running if you just keep doing this thing. Then yeah, it's like slightly faster by just a tiny margin. Odd looking tablet. This guy? That tablet looks even stranger than you. Aw, I thought we would get some answers. But all right, here we go again. So now I'm wondering, can I kill the uh, the jellyfish dudes now that I have like light sources? I mean, I, I had no, I had light sources before. That wouldn't even make any sense. But like maybe this, this hat is stronger or something? I don't know. So yeah, you can go up here. Ah, you can. Wait, so can you do that with a candle? Let me try that. Did I just not understand that? Were you supposed to learn this? Oh, you were. It's just that it's really hard to like keep them within the candle for long enough that they start... No. No, that's not it at all. They just shake, and that's nothing. I mean, that's not really a good indication that, hey, oh, if only you had a stronger light source, you could kill them. Like, that's not really something you can learn based off of that alone, I would say. I don't think that's a very good indication. But yeah, there we go. They're all dead. But I can't get up here, so that was pointless, because they'll be back. Yep. They don't stay dead like the uh, other dudes did. Oh, that's annoying. Have to tank some damage here. Oh, maybe here? Did I even... No, I guess that's nothing. And I've been down there. I've, like, come from that angle, I'm pretty sure. Whoa! What the hell? Why did that reset me completely? That's odd. And yeah. Here we have this part. Where the hell is that stupid film strip? I don't even understand where I could have left one. Yeah, this just takes me out. I can jump across there, but that doesn't do anything. And if I go here, it's just a drop down. Oh, not yet. Right there, fuck, no, I... I didn't actually want to drop down, I wanted to stop before it. Oh my fucking god. I, I don't know where to to find that. Maybe I should just look that up. Because I've been there several times and I just... I don't know where there could be a fucking film strip located. So before I go back there again, I might just want to look that up. I think I'm going to do that. One second. Alright. I know where it is, I think. And... I mean, I guess I should have just explored a bit more thoroughly, like, if I did it one more time, then maybe I would have found it, because I took the, like, top path. I was gonna check the bottom path, but then I just fell down now. But apparently there's also, like, a little secret encounter, which I don't think I would have gotten, so that's good, I suppose. But still gotta go all the way back. Oh boy. Oh, right, as I've been saying, since I'm traveling, stop! Oh, fuck you! 
Since I'm traveling, I should be doing this. Oh, well, not that. Yeah, it's definitely slightly faster if you do it properly. Alright, so here we go again. And now I just go down this way, which I've already done. And there's a bunch of these guys. Oh, this direction. Yeah, I haven't even gone here. Damn, yep, I should have probably just checked that and not looked it up. Because I didn't even realize I hadn't gone that direction, because over here is the... the fountain, yeah. All right, well, that's a thing. So there- oh! Hi! Sweet! Look at all those film strips you found in this area! Uh... What? How do I- Oh, hi! Why is he showing up now? It's said in the thing, like, oh, if you turn off all the lights, but, like, these aren't even- you just mean these lights? Because, like, this looks like something you could light, maybe. I don't even know, but I'm gonna save before I do it, because this might have some, like, uh, choices or whatever. But, alright. Hey. Do I... Can I not even have it equipped? Yeah, okay, you can't even have a light source equipped, even if you don't use it. Alright. That's some stuff. Yep. What? Oh, he's getting mad. No. Oh. Thanks. What is that? Gum gum painter. Okay. Faint glow. Is that a special one? Oh my god. What are you doing, guy? Huh? He has some, like, smileys and stuff? What is even happening? Check out this snacker guy. No? What about the police siren? It's a light. You don't like those, right? Yeah, he just disappears. Okay, what a... what a weird thing. What is that supposed to do? And let's see, if I use a match stick... Yep, I can light that, and now he will not show up anymore. I've ruined it. But I can just use the blusser... A uh, bucket, right? Yeah, and just put it out. Isn't that supposed to be on then to begin with? So you have to like go and get the bucket and then come back and turn off the light or put out the torch. I don't know. That's very strange. I've no idea what this is supposed to be. If you can translate this somehow or learn to to understand him, maybe in like New Game Plus or whatever. No clue. Hello there. Wait, hold on. Check out my snacker. Stupid looking poles. Are you done? Oh, this pole. Yeah. Wait. No, still stupid looking poles. He's not talking about the, the blusser, right? Upgrade this again. Nope. Alright, well, I guess that was something, and what was the film strip we even got? Tunnel... Bremco's Adventure Part 2. Okay, makes sense. So now... Was there something I wanted to, like, do? Well, I guess... 
I guess I would want to go... Oh, man. Yeah, I, I would have to go all the way back... Ooh, all the way back to Popo City and color my... My gum core. And then go back to this guy and just see if anything happens when you use the thing he gives you. Because I guess that's like a unique color that you can't get any other way. Maybe? Also, did I test it out? But like, if you color your gum gum gun or pellets or whatever, and then you color it a different color, do you get the color back? I'm pretty sure I did test it because I used both of the uh, rainbow colors and I didn't get it back. So they're like one-time use items, right? So if I use the, the one that I just got and I don't like it, or if I like switch off it, then I can never get it again, I think. Well, there's also... Yeah, it's like super far or uh, super long to wait, so never mind that. Don't need to do it now. There's also some... Uh... Wait, can you jump up here? Yeah, you can. Weird. Huh. But there's nothing there. There's some uh, film strips I haven't gotten from Wondersplank, and I don't know where that could be. Where could that possibly be? Hmm. I sure hope it's not that stupid mini game that you have to do even more. Wait, you already have one. Okay. Yeah, that's nothing. Joy Splank. Wait! Did I set one 108? I can't even remember at this point. Hey, remember me? Uh... Wait, I didn't do this? Did I...? Oh, I guess I did! I did... Wait, hold on, no. Oh, okay then, bye. I did reset this. Because I wanted to... Like, I didn't want to waste all that smirt. Or Wondersplank coins, or whatever she takes. But, like, I guess I could do that now? I might just want to do that on my own. Because you don't need to see that. That's gonna take way too fucking long. So I can just skip past that. I don't think there was anything that I wanted to show with that. It, it was just like, oh, you spend all the smirt, and then you get some happiness or something at the end. And pretty much nothing else. Oh well. I guess that's another episode done. Huh, man. Yeah. As I said, these are kind of just filler. It's very slow. Walking around and trying to just check things that you've already done. I mean, at least we got a film strip, got some gum core paint from a weird jellyfish spooky thing, which maybe we'll get back to at some point. I don't know. Next time, I'm gonna try just swimming out to the Blusser Islands. I'll see if I can buy a store artifact. There were some other things to buy from, from Blusser Islands, which maybe I'll buy. I don't know. We'll see when we get there. But the main thing is gonna be trying to just dive or a swim with a swimsuit past that monster and just see if that's even possible. I don't think it is, but we'll see. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.